Hello and welcome. In this video, I'm going to be sharing five of the most anticipated movies I have for the last half of the year. I know we're just a little bit over the halfway mark, but I've been so busy lately, but I still wanted to get this video out for you guys so I can talk about what I'm still excited for this year and know what you're excited for as well. So let's jump into the intro and get started on my picks. Welcome once again, my name is Austin and this channel is all about digging deeper and going further to better understand faith and film and everything that's in between. If that's exciting to you, make sure you click that subscribe button down below so you don't miss out on any future content. Now before I give my picks, I want to know from you, comment down below what the movies you are still highly anticipating that are coming out this year. I'm going to be going in reverse order from five to the most anticipated. First, coming in the fifth slot for me and my pick for most anticipated movies still to come out this year, we have Spider-Man 3 No Way Home. Now, this is a movie that has a ton of mystery surrounding it, and I'm a big fan of the MCU, and if we get even a little bit of the rumors that have been revolving around this film, I'm going to love it. At the very least, I cannot wait to see Alfred Molina return from my favorite Spider-Man movie and revisit the role of Dr. Octopus and I know that's at least a confirmation, so I'm just happy we're getting that because that is hands down probably my favorite villain from the original Spider-Man trilogy. Next in the fourth slot, I'm gonna go with Halloween Kills. Now, if you've been following my channel for a while, you know that I only just got into the Halloween franchise last year, but the way I got into it is I watched the original and then I watched the 2018 Halloween that was the kind of the direct sequel to that first one. Since then, I have gone back and I did watch Halloween 2 didn't really like it that much. I do really want to check out Halloween 3 Season of the Witch this year because I've heard that took more of an anthology take on the Halloween franchise, but I'm really excited to see what's coming next as far as Michael Myers himself in Halloween Kills. I really liked the trailers that we've gotten so far for the film, and if we get anything like what those trailers have shown so far, it's going to be another great Halloween film. Next in the third spot, I don't remember from when I made my initial top 10 anticipated for this year if this movie was even on my radar, but at this point, this movie is highly anticipated for me. Obviously, it's in my third spot, and that is going to be Edgar Wright's next film, Last Night in Soho. I cannot wait to see what Edgar Wright does next. It's going to be really cool to see him delve into the horror genre. Again, he kind of did it some in Shaun of the Dead, but that was a bit more of a comedy horror blend, so I'm really excited to see what he does when he goes fully into the horror genre. He has such cool, unique style as a filmmaker. Some of his films are some of my favorites of all time, most particularly Hot Fuzz, so I cannot wait to see what he does with this. I'm really excited about the cast, the story, what we've seen so far. Really looking forward to it. Next, in my number two spot, we have Daniel Craig's final run as the titular James Bond in No Time to Die. This one is one that's been a long time coming as it was initially supposed to come out last year and got bumped to this year. Fingers crossed we can get it because I'm highly anticipating it. I even went back and rewatched all of the Daniel Craig Bond movies leading up to when this was supposed to come out earlier this year, so I might just have to go watch them all again because overall it's been a great franchise, a solid run, and there have been some excellent spy action movies, and I can't wait to see how they wrap things up for this character. Finally, the probably obvious pick in my number one slot, we have Dune. Denis Villeneuve is one of the greatest directors working today. I cannot wait to see the result of this movie. This has been years in the making, obviously like most movies have, but especially this one because we were supposed to have gotten this movie almost a year ago now, and it was bummed when it initially got bumped into this year, but finally the time is approaching. We just got a couple months left. I can't wait to see this movie on the biggest screen I can find. Denis Villeneuve has made some excellent movies so far, and the cast for this film is an absolutely phenomenal cast with so many different talented actors involved in the project. Not only that, we have the masterful Hans Zimmer composing the score. I've already been listening to the audio tracks for two of the songs that have been released this far, and if that is a sign of what we're going to be getting for the rest of this film, I cannot wait. So that is going to be my number one most anticipated movie for the year. A part of the reason I wanted to do this too is because I was watching a top 10 most anticipated for the rest of the year video the other day, and I could not believe 
that this person didn't have Dune even anywhere in their top 10. So I knew I had to make sure I got it out there on my list because this is a highly anticipated movie that I cannot wait to see on the big screen. So don't forget, comment down below with your picks for what you're most anticipating coming out at the rest of this year. I look forward to seeing what you got to pick and enjoying the conversation down below. Thank you for checking out this video and sticking around to the end. I'll see you in the next one.